Hello, we're back. Now we're gonna make some minestrone. Um, vegan minestrone back in the Instapot. I keep cleaning this thing out and firing it back up. So without further ado, we're gonna get busy. So here we go. I am gonna pour some olive oil in the bottom of this pan. Probably like a tablespoon or something like that. In here I have chopped up onion and a fennel bulb and there we go I'm gonna throw that in and have it brown along with about five cloves of garlic there's a lot of garlic it's a garlicky thing so we'll just leave that in there for a bit and then we'll be back all right we're sauteing away I'm gonna add two cups of chopped carrots We're just kind of stir those in there. Oh, it smells really, really good. If we had smell vision on YouTube, you'd be just in heaven. The aroma is fantastic. Turn it off. So, here we go. I've sauteed all this stuff up for about three, four minutes. Now I am going to pour in all the rest of the stuff. So I have four cups of the vegetable stock. I have one can of diced tomatoes. I have a cup of penne pasta. And some of them dropped out here, so I am going to grab them and throw them in. And then I have two cans of white beans. I mixed cannellini and Great Northern together. I drain them and clean them up. I'll hit this with a little stir. And then I'm going to add spice. Now, they said two tablespoons of Italian spice, but I don't really have any Italian spice by itself. So we have thyme. I have some parsley that I'll just kind of get irritated and take the top off because that's annoying. Parsley. I have oregano. And I have basil. Oh, that smells good. Okay. And then probably hit it with a little tiny bit of salt not a lot because I'm not a fan of salting things up too much but if you've watched my show here you know that I'm not a fan of salting things up so I have the lid on I'm going to cook it on high pressure for 10 minutes All right, we'll be back. All right, we are done. And wow, this looks so excellent. I am going to serve up a couple of lovely bowls of it. Because I have my favorite friend Patty here to eat. Doesn't that look delish? So, this will be the end of our programming for today. I hope that everyone has a lovely week. I am going to eat like a pig with the fresh bread that I made while all of this was cooking. Bread is pretty basic, so I didn't film it. But, if anybody wants me to film it, just write it down in the comments and I will make more bread and film it. Until next time, this is Grandma Terry, signing off.